there's some fantastic opportunities here at Wing Canton. So there's apprenticeships, uh, we do graduates, and uh, we do normal, obviously, intake um, from the local area. Uh, when we talk about apprenticeships, we do a train programme, usually over two years. The graduate schemes tend to be about 18 months. Before I worked here, I worked at another distribution centre at B&Q, and I worked there for two years um, on an agency role. Um, I did go to college, but it was in, in nothing to do with this. I just worked, I first got an agency role because I just wanted a job and the money, and then I've progressed into this role where I am now. I had some friends who were working here, and they uh, really enjoyed it, so I thought I'd take the opportunity to come try it, and I've been here ever since. So really, come out of school with, with nothing. Nothing really out there apart from the local shoe factory. And through hard work and dedication to my job, then obviously I got uh, made supervisor, team leader, then up to contract manager. When we're recruiting an individual, a multitude of different roles again, being a team player is quite important. Uh, we work in obviously large teams of people within the operation, all in our finance sectors or other parts of the business. So when we look to obviously um, advertise a role, whether that be an apprentice, when we use some of our partners and they use Indeed, Total Jobs. We also use our own website. From a senior position, we then look towards LinkedIn. So it's quite important to have a LinkedIn account if you're looking to develop your career. Uh, I would like to progress within the company. Um, eventually I'd like to see myself in a team leader role. Yeah, so, so my role, there's 24 staff under me. So my main role is uh, to, to plan and forecast, um, basically just overviewing everything what's happening for the day shift. I got a good opportunity to go to university. I did a business and management degree and uh, achieved a 2-1 qualification. I then went on to the Sainsbury's graduate programme uh, within logistics and worked at Haydock Distribution Centre. I then numerous different roles throughout the graduate programme at Sainsbury's and on to a shift manager position which is looking after an operation um, which is a shed base size uh, within our business. From there I had an opportunity to be a deputy store manager at a place called Bamber Bridge again with Sainsbury's uh, and that broadened my horizons to retail and the industry. And at which point I then came back into logistics through Wincanton and was the assistant general manager at B&Q Doncaster. And then I got a fantastic opportunity to be here at Wincanton Tracks Park uh, where I look after a multitude of different customers. Well I'd like to personally see myself in the future progressing to be a team leader or a supervisor. My advice to probably a younger self or obviously a young person looking to come into logistics is that it's tough but yeah it's rewarding. My advice to give to a younger person coming into this industry is to just go for it. I've, I've come out of school with nothing, yeah. There's opportunities out there if you're willing to work hard. There's loads of opportunities in Wincanton. I currently work in transport, there's finance, HR, there's working with food in the warehouse. Within Wincanton, um, there have been loads of opportunities for me. There's uh, training courses, uh, projects to get involved in. I've been supported and pushed and obviously bearing the fruits of where I got to with being contract manager and obviously there's scope to go beyond that, which I'm looking forward to working with in Canton with.